hi guys welcome to the first vlog for 2024 hey <laughs> hi guys um what am i doing um yeah so i'm up super early i just plopped this wig on my head it's not even glued down i'm not sure if i'm gonna wear her but i got my base and everything on right now and i'm about to do a quick tutorial for um tiktok and i'll probably upload it on my youtube shorts as well but we got going on i use this mirror right here so i can see what i'm doing hey <laughs> and yes this is my hot mess of a desk right now because i did not clean up after yesterday's session and yeah this is what we got going on so i have to be at work in about two hours i'm hoping to film this video in about like 45 minutes because i'm going to do a quick look using the wet and wild palette and um yes yeah, new year's eve so i'm not trying to do all special looks and stuff like that i'm just trying to do something really quick and easy because i'm tired okay and i wasn't going to do a full-on video because i think i already filmed one um day before yesterday for this um palette so i got a little thing that i want to be doing on my channel for now on and i'm trying to see how that's a big old juicy bomb January is gonna go and if things go as planned then it's gonna be an amazing 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 year for this channel I'm already gonna claim it it is gonna be an amazing year for this channel and I pray that anyone that is watching I pray that you have a successful a joyful peaceful year okay like those three combos right there need it okay and of course i pray that you guys find a relationship with god as well so that way you can have your faith journey on a whole nother level because it's definitely needed because boy was i pushed and challenged last year i had went through so many ups more downs that i feel like i you know more downs but <laughs> look i can go on and on let me go ahead and get started on this tutorial Kind of corny. <laughs> I feel so corny when I be doing my little highs on TikTok and, and bounce with it, bounce with it. <laughs> All right, and we gotta show the palette. Boom. That's what we're using. Open her up, girl. You messed that up. Couldn't open it. Look, this is behind the scenes of Epic Fail. Okay, let's try it again. Okay, show the palette. Ooh. So I gotta go ahead and quickly pop on something on my lid. And I'm not doing a cut crease because honestly, y'all, I need to quickly kind of sort of get dressed. I don't know if I won't be able to do it. But I have a video that I need to edit before going to work. And I also need to do a quick little store run. Um, we ran out of paper towels last night and trash bags. And if I can't get to the store, that right there is not really urgent. Oh, my kids need a milk too. So that's not really urgent. Like they can survive until I get off of work. But I was just trying to be nice and helpful and have some things here for daddy while I'm at work. So. Let's go ahead and now my brush is dirty. My brushes are freaking dirty. That is definitely gonna be a task for me probably later on today. But if I get off at a decent time, being that it's New Year's Eve, I don't have any plans to do anything. I'm probably gonna come back home, cook dinner for the family, and then do like a late night session to where I can film another video. If I can't get to it, then it's cool, but I try to at least push myself to at least do some type of film at least once a day and I do give myself like a, a break one day out of the week so that way my skin and everything can recover <laughs> from me putting on makeup and stuff like that but if I can get some good film sessions in 
if I get two a day, I definitely take full advantage of that. And I've been doing that since the kids been out of school has been very, very wonderful. I am done getting dressed for work. I have a little bit of a spare time to where I can try my best to edit this video. It's just a quick little, um, what am I uploading today? Um, my pa palette playlist. So it was just a quick video. I kind of did half of it last night, but I was so tired. So I had to save what I had done and then, um, I told myself I was going to get up a little bit more earlier today to finish up, but I didn't do that. And I don't need to go to the store. Um, Daddy's going to go to the store. Yes, I call my man Daddy. I'm just going to <laughs> My husband's going to go to the store. Uh, yeah. He, I told him, he said, I'll just go to the store later. So excited. Like, my anxiety is just, like, up here. Cause I've been waiting patiently to do this video because I'm like, what are we gonna bring for the new year? What's gonna be the, the you know, the runoff, the start off? I'm like, what's gonna be the, the playlist for the palettes? Like, what are we playing with? Like, how are we? Does anyone get like cringy like when you're watching yourself? I kind of do. I don't know why. I just like, <laughs> like, how do we start the year off? It's very important on how the year can continue. So I got a little bit of tricks and stuff up my sleeve on how I plan on doing like my videos for January and then for of course the following year. But January is gonna it's gonna change this time around. I promise you because y'all gonna see okay because I've been doing a lot of pre filming already. I don't know how I did it, y'all, but I did it. I edited the video. It is uploading right now. It should be done uploading by the time I go to work. That was a bit of a struggle. I'm glad I did not talk so much in that video. Because sometimes I could just be right in my mouth. But I did pretty good. Um, so when I get back home tonight, I do have to upload another video um, that I would like to be up today as well. And like I said, I want to try to come back and... Uh, um, I don't know how where to look on my phone. Look at myself or look at this little corner right here. Probably the little corner right here. So, um, yeah, I'll come back and be able to film a look. I'm supposed to be doing a co-worker's eyes today for New Year's Eve. Um, I just brought my whole kit just in case because, yeah, yeah. Uh, so, I'll be doing her eyes. I don't know if I will reveal who she is. Or show her because I don't like showing my co workers and stuff like that. How weird. Because <laughs> once I start filming, they're going to be like, What? You do YouTube? I'm like, Uh, never mind. <laughs> God, I don't need y'all watching me. I feel weird. <laughs> like, if I know you in person and I know you watch me, like, don't tell me. Keep it a secret. Please don't tell me because I'm going to feel weird. Like, Why? What? What? You're watching me? Ew. Why? <laughs> you know me in real life. Why? <laughs> But anyway, I am on the way, on my way to work. I think I'm going to um, order some donuts today because my favorite friend, my best friend, uh, my co-worker, my boo thing, she's my little boo thing, uh, she's finally back at work. I haven't seen her yet. She came back Friday and uh, I don't even think I vlogged about it, but she had injured her foot and I had took her, I was at work with her that day, she had injured her foot, and I didn't think she had, you know, was anything bad, but she was like in tears, and she never cries, like she and she, like she never cries. So I was like, oh my God, I, was like, I think you need to go to the hospital. Like she was trying to stay at work, and I was like, no, you need to go. I was like, I've never seen you cry, and she was like barely able to walk on her foot. So I was like, we're going to take you to home. I said, either you go to the emergency room or home, but you're not staying here. I said, you can't, not like, not in that condition. 
Yo, why did we? Why did I take her to the emergency room? I sat with her the whole entire time. I think it was like a good five-hour process. That's a BFF right there for you. But y'all, she broke her foot. I didn't. We both was like surprised when the doctor came back. I was like, she what? <laughs> At work from tripping over somebody? Like, oh my god, it was yeah. So she's been out of work for about almost two months since the week before Thanksgiving, and she just came back Friday. So I miss the heck out of her. I need to see her ASAP. So donuts is definitely a celebration for us. I wish I had some balloons and stuff like that, but. Yeah, but she knows I love her, so I'm excited to see my Lucilla. I am so proud of myself. So, being that today is officially the first day of the new year, January 3rd. Uh, 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 uh. So, I have a goal that I'm doing for this month, not only on this channel, but of course my other channel, um, fitness wise, you know. But part of my fitness journey um, is to be consistent on waking up at six o'clock in the morning to make sure that I get the things that I need to do out of the way so that way I have time to actually have time to work out, you know, and have time for Bible study and, and time for other stuff that needs to be done. And y'all ain't gonna lie, today I woke up, it was like 6.15 and I was like, uh-uh, I'm ready to go back to sleep. <laughs> I went to sleep I actually like two-ish in the morning so yeah so i was really tired so i was like let me just lay here for a little bit and then i'll slowly wake up and the more i kept reminding myself i was like no you made a commitment to yourself let's not let the first day go to fail like already so i started texting on my phone and it wasn't the right way because i wanted to wake up with a prayer and in the bible but i had to fully wake up with my phone woke up did what i needed to do and came in here i was like let me get my filming done because my kids are still sleeping and i actually did two videos um i'm actually in the middle of doing one because i'm doing a product review but i'm so proud of myself because there was no crying in the background there was none of that and i'm so proud of myself because it's only 10 o'clock now 10 o'clock i did a hair review well did i film that no i didn't i did it with myself <laughs> So I wasn't sure how this wig was going to come out, but this is a new wig, so I unboxed her, and she looks really good. I think I might like her. I think she's a, a replacement to my favorite curly wig, so I'm going to see how she holds up. I felt like I needed to flatten this a little bit. This is too high for my liking, but I'm trying to wait for it to naturally drop and fall on itself, but... This looks really good. I'm so proud of myself. So now I'm about to do some Bible studying and then I'm about to do some editing because I need to have a video up by three o'clock today. Actually, I have two videos that needs, that needs to go up today. So maybe 12 and three is going to be my time slots for today to have my videos up, especially if I'm going to upload two videos. So let me do that and get the rest of my chores done because we're starting this year off on being productive and I'm so here for it. All right, so I did change, I did redid my face because I was not gonna take an opportunity of not filming another look. So I did because I am going out to eat with a couple of my friends slash coworkers. I'm so excited because I haven't been out in a while, in a while, while. I think I mentioned it like in one of my tutorials that I was going out to eat with one of my coworkers. Uh, we had to cancel it because we were all honestly just tired. So this time around, I was like, hey, we're going to start the new year, right? At least go out with them at least twice a month. Every two weeks or something like that. And that's because I need a girls night out, okay? So that's what we're going to be having. Um, so let me show you guys what I have on really quick. Because so I think I'm trying to figure out. Uh, I don't have any like white boots. And the boots I had picked out, sorry, making you guys dizzy. Uh, the boots I had picked out, I'm not sure if they're gonna go with this. <sighs> I wish you guys can answer me right away, but you guys can't. So I have these boots right here, but you see they're kind of like beige, so beige and white. I don't know, what that, no. But the brown in these, I feel like will kind of play off in my top that I'm gonna wear. 
look if it don't match i'm just gonna wear it anyway because i don't have any other game plans because i need my feet done and i'll probably do that tomorrow because i need a pedicure and i'm tired of wearing closed toe shoes i am not a boots person i prefer me some sandals flip-flops like that's my type of shoe game i'm regular when it comes to that i don't do heels <laughs> I might try to embrace them a little bit this year because I'm trying to get into my grown woman status. Okay? So I might. <laughs> Alright, these are my jeans I have on. I cannot wait to lose my mom gut, y'all. And then let's see. Because it's a little chilly. It wasn't really that cold earlier today, but definitely is now. And I would wear a belt, but I have no clue where my belts are. And honestly, I don't know if I can even fit them anymore. I need to get going because I got to go pick up Priscilla. Oh, I did my face really good today. Yes. Going to my favorite place. I'm back. Let me show you guys what I got. If they have anything left, I'm going to tell y'all this. Get this one. This smells really, really, really good. I'm going to look on the website and see if they have like the matching body wash. Right. Because no. they really didn't have no, right? anything left for this one. So I got the matching lotion. I picked up a couple of other ones. I think they're like they're all the same like collection. I think they have the same packaging. These were good. Yes. Yes. I'm looking at the notes of them. Sorry. Um, and then I just picked up a couple of hand sanitizers. And then of course, gotta get some for the man's. And then I picked up two of the holiday soaps that was on sale. These were 50% off. 50% off of a 50% off of seven dollars. That was a steal. That was a steal. So those that was 50% off, and each of these were $4.95 each. And I think the sale is still gonna be going on by the time you guys see this video. Um I'll be sure to have everything listed down at the bottom. But I mainly went to get the kids, teachers, and them something because I forgot to get them something before they had one on their winter break. So I got them now. So I got them all three. A little something. They each got one of the three collection of these. So they all got a different one. So they got a body soap, Raya, stop, a hand sanitizer. And I put a Starbucks gift card in there. I was trying to look for some cute like little yeah. cups, like a tea cup, coffee cup, but I didn't make my way to Target. So this is all I got so far. I think they'll be thankful and appreciative yeah. to it anyway. So <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and I think that's it. We went out to eat again to the noodle place. I didn't show anything because I was just enjoying the moment, but uh yeah that's all i did today i look a hot mess 
don't I? Yes, my face has been breaking out. I tried to give my face a break from makeup today. I just have on under eye concealer and I just did my eyebrows. That was it. Ooh. Ooh, it's so gloomy today. I look red in my camera. I'm not even gonna adjust the lighting because I'm gonna need it to be what it be, you know, when I film my videos in my makeup room. But it's so gloomy today. So I'm on my way to work. I'm in my hoopty. This man has still have yet to clean out my car. This is like my first, my first hoop, my first car that I bought myself, paid off by myself. So she's still in the family of getting me around to where I need to go. But um, what's I about to say, y'all? It is freaking raining, and look what I got on. I have on this white blouse with this black shirt and some black legging pants yeah this is what i'm wearing to wear because i just wasn't in the mood to really get dressed today so yeah it is what it is my makeup was like really really dark i was trying to see if this was gonna grow on me i don't know how i feel about it she looked really cute in my room <laughs> with all the lights but now i'm like she's really dark i wasn't leaning towards that today yeah, I don't know what's up with my hormones, but it feels really good out here. Like, I can stay out here for a while. It doesn't feel cold. It's like the perfect breeze, like right now. It's like, feels amazing. But I just got back from walking to El Pollo Loco because I didn't bring no food. So, I'll show you guys what I get, what I got, what I get, <laughs> what I got in a minute once I sit down for my break. I got my tortilla chips. I got my favorite salad. Oh my gosh, salad is bomb. And then I got my chickens and my two sides, which are rice and beans. And of course, my tortilla shell. This food is so bomb right now, y'all. I love a pollo loco chicken. Mm -mm -mm. It's so hot. Just hurting my teeth. I can learn how to make this kind of chicken at home. It'll be perfect. Okay, so where's my turning tripod? Oh, here it is. All right, so I'm putting you guys on my mini tripod. That I'm on that sits up a little bit higher. Um. Okay, so today I'm off for work. Usually I work today, um, but I'm off today and my husband's off too. Okay, so we're about to film some content today. I'm off of work today, so um, usually when both of us is home. <laughs> Excuse me. I can film more videos and today is one of those days so he didn't have to go into work and I didn't have to go into work so spend quality time a little bit watch TV and stuff like that he started to fall asleep so I took that was my opportunity to exit stage left and come in here and get some filming done um, I was on the couch editing some videos um, of course I did not finish so I was like, hmm, let me try to get some videos in while the kids are at school. So, uh, yeah, little man is taking a nap with dad, with his daddy, and I'm about to get these videos in. So, I pretty much filmed all the videos that I needed to film for, uh, for this for this week that you guys are probably already seen so now anything that i found from today and for the rest of this week it's just going to be extra videos so usually i do this probably like once or twice a week uh is i'll film like two videos into one filming day i usually don't like doing that because honestly i cling to a look that i put on to where i don't want to take it off <laughs> and then um sometimes i feel like i'm rushed depending on how I do it. So my ideal on how I do it. So today, um, I'm just gonna shoot for one video today, one makeup tutorial, 
And then, being that I don't have to go to work tomorrow either. It's actually my son's birthday tomorrow. Well, I gotta tell y'all a funny story about that. But yeah, I probably film like late at night. Usually I do that when I can't sleep and everybody else is asleep. I'll be in the room like 12 o'clock in the morning filming a video. So, I don't know. I do plan on doing two videos for now that I know I'm saying it out loud, being that my son's birthday is tomorrow. I'm not going to film my two videos that I usually do on Fridays. Fridays are definitely my double filming day because kids are at the school. So, I ain't got to worry about, you know, them being on a proper sleep schedule. And then my oldest usually watches them when I'm um, in here. So, yes, mom life. You got to get in when you can fit in your time so being that I told you I already filmed all the videos I was going to film so I don't know what palettes I'm going to be using I guess I'm going to figure this out so how I do it I film shop my stash on usually Fridays or Saturdays to have them up on Sundays so usually I'll start using the products that day but today's only Thursday should I get a head start on that I don't know y'all I'm just my train of thought is just going everywhere maybe I'll film another look using this palette today because I that's what I had on yesterday was that blue smoky eye was with this palette that video should be up already so I think I'm gonna film a look using this palette um let's see what else was part of my shop my stash I didn't forget I gotta look at the video again uh, I've been using my products. I'm so proud of myself. I use every product. Oh, that's what we can try out today. This is part of Shop My Stash. We're going to try out this NYX Freeze Primer. I don't know if I'm going to do like a legit wear test. I think I just might be a wear test. I mean, what the heck did I just say? I don't know. So I might do that. And then what would be if I film another look? What can I squeeze in? I think I might do a blue look. I've been gra I grabbed a lot of blue palettes for this month, so yeah. Okay. Oh, let me show you. I'm, look, let me get this film in. My kids will be home within two hours. So let me at least for sure get one video in before they come home. I'm just do my eyebrows really quick. I'll t look, I'll talk here and be here forever and not focus and concentrate what I'm supposed to be doing. So I'll see you guys in a few. All right, you're over here low key. Oh. Okay, so I finished the look, a look. Um, I did do two videos, but not two makeup tutorials. So I did a makeup tutorial on the eyes using a notepad. <laughs> Why can I not talk? <laughs> using the Nomad palette. And then I did the product review that I said I was going to do, which is this Freeze Primer. And I don't know how to feel about her. Like... She was a weird feel. Like right now my eye is still cooling down. So I think I got a little bit too close to my eyeballs. But other than that, I think my face looks absolutely gorgeous. I just couldn't really describe like the feel of it. But overall I think she lit, did a really, really good job. Yeah. So I'm doing a weird test on her. So I can't do my second tutorial i probably do like I said I was going to do later on tonight. Other than that, if I don't get to film two tutorials, that's fine. I did get two videos in and that's better than nothing. Um, Yeah, but I'm going to edit a video because I need to have a video up now in about uh, two hours because it's that time crunch. But I'm been trying to be like social media and this is hard. Like I feel like I need a assistant. I need to teach my dog because I need a uh, seriously an assistant to help me manage like all this. Like I don't know how y'all do it. Like sheesh. But, like if I get to the point to where I can afford an assistant, I'm going to pay for one. So I really need to get my daughter on on board on helping me with this because this social media thing, like being a makeup influencer, whatever you want to call it, content creator. It takes some time like it takes a lot of time and I'll be trying to take so much time away from my family being that I'm doing most of my work at home like usually people go out and work and do an eight to nine hour shift but for me I feel like being a content creator 
it's kind of like an all day thing like you gotta kind of like prioritize pri prior i cannot say that word for the life of me prior y'all know what i'm gonna say i can't why can i not say this word but manage your time when it comes to um balancing your family and being a content creator like definitely it takes a little bit of some time and i don't know why i put this summer dress on maybe because i wasn't going anywhere but if i do end up going somewhere i'm just gonna throw some boots on and a sweater jacket a sweater because it's sweater weather sweater weather sweater weather i really need to go get my feet done no shade but my feet is looking like they need a prayer on it like see oh my gosh my feet is so ridiculous i broke my big toe y'all and it has polish lingering on it and the rest of my toes polishes off but i need this big toe to grow because it don't make sense for me to go get my feet done i gotta get my feet done regardless i, I just i got an ugly big toenail they might have to put like a fake toenail in there it's like really i really like janked it up okay but let me post on my social media. I told my year, I said I was gonna be a little bit more moments after my husband dropped an F-bomb waiting on traffic. My six year old, okay. I don't wanna see that one, okay. So let's post on Instagram. I already had the video saved. So I just need to put some music over it and I'll be good. Yeah, so this is the look that you guys already seen. Um, music. Where is the video I edit today? Cause that's that's not it. That's crazy. Hold up, that's weird. Okay, let's try it again. I would upload an old video. Okay. Next, edit the cover. Y'all, I'm about to screw it up. This hair gets on my nerves, but it's so cute. All right, I think I like that frame. Bring that down. All right, video is posted on, video is posted on um, Instagram. That's it for social media right now. I'll post again for TikTok later on tonight. But let me edit this video so I can have some sort of video on YouTube. This is everything that I got from El Pollo Loco. We got 12 pieces of chicken in here. I got a side of the rice and then a side of the pinto beans and a local salad. And I had to ask for this before I left the drive through because I was like, oh, can I get the green sauce? And she's like, oh yeah, here you go. I'm supposed to get this automatically for free, so I should have two. All this was forty five dollars. Forty five dollars. I didn't even get their corn. I like my corn better, so I'm making me some corn for the kiddos. I'm gonna show you how to elevate an El Pollo Loco meal. Okay, I'm gonna show you how to make my delicious little burritos <laughs> with the little tortilla shells. So I got me two of them, and I'm gonna bring the camera down so y'all can see what I do. I'm telling you, this is like, I don't just eat everything separate. Like, ugh, I make my own little burrito thing. So, let me show you what I'm talking about. All right, so we got the two tortilla shell. Couldn't even get that out, tortilla shell. Next, we're gonna grab a piece of chicken. A piece of chicken. Let me get down to my daughter Ross voice. A piece of chicken, you're gonna shred this chicken up. And we're gonna evenly divide it into the two tortilla shells that we got going on. Oh yeah, this is so delicious. It's like a country western <laughs> white girl voice. Yeah, crazy. Okay. So after you evenly distribute a chicken, you want to get every piece of strand of meat on here because we spent forty dollars on this. You know what I'm saying? You gotta get every little bit of oh chicken here. Now if you feel a little greedy, you can do chicken number two. And you know what? <laughs> I'm gonna do a chicken number two. This time I'm gonna grab a smaller piece right here. Put that all over the shell, yes. And it sees a little bit left over. I'm gonna eat it. All right, that chicken was so good. All right, so now what I'm gonna do is take some beans. 
It's like he knew when to do what he did. Then we're gonna do the same thing for the rice. Scoop the rice. Playing when he said that. It's almost as if he was looking through it. You know. Ready, which is gonna be some cheese. Gonna um, take some cheese, sprinkle some of that on there. So yes, you are gonna pop this in the microwave. I like to squeeze a lemon over this, but ain't got no lemon, so I got a lime. So I'm gonna squeeze some of that. <laughs> squeeze. That's why I prefer lemons, because lemon has more juice, but I'm cool. Last thing is to add some sour cream. Woo! Yeah, who put this back in the refrigerator like this? Who? Who put this back in the refrigerator like this? Oh my goodness. My family, I swear. Ooh. Okay, they better finish this tonight because this is not refrigeratable. Not, okay? So also that comes with this. What about these individually like this at El Pollo Loco? Each burrito would have cost me probably about like $8 and some more change. Thick, fulfilling, I can't even scoop them. And that's how I like it. Look at that. It's like a taco burrito. It's the main thing I need to cut out of my habit. Yeah, I've been drinking so much Pepsi lately. And I think that's definitely one of the reasons why I'm having sugar highs and weight gain. But according to the scale, I lost a pound, so. And then I got a side salad too. If I ever get a salad from El Pollo Loco, get the sauce. The sauce, okay? I don't know what this was in this sauce. Of course, it's called the cilantro dressing. And I've tried other cilantro dressing because of this, and they're not this. El Pollo Loco, I'ma need y'all to sell this at the market, okay? Because I want it. They're charging 50 cents for this. 50 cents. So you know I was pressing for my free one, right? And she was gonna try to not give me one? Man, I got a couple of, couple of those in my refrigerator. See that? Made me a little local, real local um, salad. You know what? I might as well use this. Y'all, my, my oldest son turns four. Happy birthday, Papa! <laughs> Come on, we had to get ready for school. I mean, we had to get going to school. Come on. <laughs> Y'all, I feel like a bad parent. I almost forgot about his birthday. I literally ordered his shirt 
Wednesday on Amazon and it came on time. Thanks for that Amazon Prime. Show me your shirt. Hold on. Look, the shirt says, I'm four and this is how I roll. Roll out. Roll out. Look at the shirt. Wait, let mommy see your shirt. Thank you, Amazon, for the quickness. Yes. All right, y'all ready? Daddy. <laughs> come on. Goofball, come on. Go. Go, go, go. Y'all know the routine. Go, go, go. Let's get out these doors. Hold my hand. I don't know why you do this every time. This be my first time dropping you guys off in like three weeks. So daddy dropped you guys off the other days. I almost forgot how to do this, y'all. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. You know I gotta put Leon in first. Get in here, big boy. One kid in. Uh, yeah, we gotta buy you the booster seat, Lariah. Leon cannot fit this car seat anymore. Get in there, one. Oh. <laughs> no crying, it's yours. Y'all destroyed mommy's car. It's a mess in here. Alright. We're getting a new car seat, okay? Yeah. Whew. Oh, that was a struggle. Forgot how to do all that. That process took, what, 10 minutes? <laughs> Oh, Bubba, I could have bought you some cupcakes or some cookies. Maybe I'll come back later and drop some off. I'll ask him if it's okay. Nice decent wig on your head. And at least have your eyebrows on, girl. Because that makes a big difference. Look, I have nothing else on. No primer, no foundation, nothing. I just have my eyebrows on and I feel so cute. I just feel so cute. I just need to get my eyebrows micro. What's it called? Microblade? I just need to get it done. I just need to find a good place out here that does it, and then I'll think about getting it done. Why can y'all not see me? Okay. Whew. Yes, that was a bit of a struggle today. So, um, as you can, like I said, today is Levon's birthday, my oldest son's birthday. Y'all pushing buttons on this car. I don't even know what I just did. Go back media no media I don't even think I brought my phone yes I did but um yeah so when I dropped him off me and baby boy we're gonna do a couple of errands and get some stuff for him I'm just debating if I really should go out right now and get some stuff for him and the reason being is because I forgot about his birthday I, I'm not even lying you guys like I didn't forget about it back there, but the time came so quickly right after Christmas and the holidays. And I always forget. This is like the fourth year of me doing this. Who's honking? Who honking? Don't honk at me, girl. We can't go nowhere. The light's not green. I don't know what that honk was from, though. But anywho. Um. Um. What was I saying? That's so distracting me. Also, because I forgot, you know, it came so quickly, I ordered his cake at the last minute. I'm glad Walmart accepted the day before his birthday. Well, it wasn't day before, two days before his birthday. But the earliest I can pick his cake up is at six o'clock tonight. So being that I have to go to Walmart to pick his cake up, it doesn't make sense for me to get his balloons and stuff until I go over there. So, and then I guess get his gift there. So I don't know. I'm gonna call them and see if I can kind of pick it up early. I was kind of hoping to get it while he's at school so he can come home to a surprise. But honestly, he's not gonna realize what's going on. He is the one that has autism, but my baby is growing. He's developing, he's smart as heck, and I just, I'm excited. I can't believe he's four now, like wow. Leon, you, <laughs> I'm gonna upgrade your seat, boo, okay? 
I know you're tired of turning around. You're so nosy. Yes, I'm talking about you. We're gonna get you another car seat. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, my big babies. Mm -hmm. Birthday boy, birthday boy, Bubba. Mm -hmm. Birthday boy, birthday boy, Bubba. Mm -hmm. Birthday boy, Bubba. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Oh, that teacher's not there. Let's go to the front. So I don't know why the teachers were, weren't at the drop-off door because they still got like three minutes before the bell rings. They kind of annoy me just a little bit, but maybe I just need to come a little bit earlier. But it's a stupid getting all three of these kids up. And it was my first time doing it after, what, two weeks of break? So, yeah, so. What are we going to do, little man? Huh? What are we going to do? Huh? Hi, Mian. Hi. Hi. Oh, that was me. Hi. Hi. So yes, this is gonna be his new seat. That's gonna be Levant now. I just gotta um, get Lariya a new seat, which is gonna be a booster seat because she don't need this whole strap system and stuff like that. She's pretty big, so. I'm gonna get rid of this. I wanted to Target because I spent too much in Target. Well, but I think I'm gonna go into Target and probably pick up and look up some birthday things for um Yeah, that's what I'll do. I'll do that. So I won't I'll so that way I won't have like completely like nothing for him. So I'm gonna go to Target, get some balloons, give him some toys, wrap them up, and have them, you know, on the somewhere around the house where so when he does come home he can see that and then we can do the cake celebration later on tonight maybe we'll go to like a jumping place or something okay yes yeah, so we got money in the account we got money in the account she didn't spend it all on makeup i didn't spend it all on makeup say hi boo boo why don't we picking out the yellow ones y'all and i wanted this green one but it's cracked. Yeah. But I did put one in the basket. 30% off. $7. It's not bad. I remember when they first came out, I told myself I wanted some more. Oh, I think this would be really cute for Larry. Ah. Oh, she likes her. These, these type of jackets that you zip up. But are these the crop top ones? I don't know if she's super comfortable wearing crop tops. Oh, Bobby, her. How much is this? I want it for myself, but of course I get it for her too. Uh, $21. This was not part of the plan. Let me get from, from over here. But also, I need some teas. This is where I usually get my t shirts at. As you can see, I have one on right now. This is my lounge t-shirts some pants my boots hey <laughs> you're so cute oh they sweatpants okay Tarjay. look this is why they wouldn't come in here y'all because i knew my focus was going to be oh but they got the are these long sleeve or short sleeve these are long sleeve be back in five minutes so i decided i'm going to order a booster seat on amazon because Target charging $60. And I can get the whole like system for $60 on Amazon. You mean like the ones that the kids, you know, the ones the kids got in the car already. So I'm like, y'all charging $60 for a half of a full on seat and it's just the bottom part. So yeah, I order on Amazon, but it won't get here until Sunday. I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna go home and browse some more, but we're in the toy section. Leah, what are we getting, brother? Huh? You don't know? He likes cars. He loves Spider-Man. Yeah, I'm over here. I don't know why picking out a nail color and also picking out a nail design is so hard for me. <laughs> like, I'd be here for hours looking at nail design because I feel like once you get that particular color on or that design and it does not look right you're stuck with that for like another two three weeks unless you got money and stuff to be sitting here and just getting it redone whenever you want to but me i'd be a little bit more smart on my nails 
I was getting them done like every two and a half weeks last year. And then towards like the holiday, I was like, okay, this is, this is crazy. Like I'm spending way too much money on my nails to be getting them done so often. I mean, like if it's a special occasion or something and I need them to get them done to change it like the color or something and then, okay, cool. But I like color and I try to be this girl to get this black set. Okay, but this is plain to me. This is so, so plain. And she was like, kind of like shocked that I just wanted a simple design. I was like, yeah, it's New Year's, Christmas, you know, I don't want to get a flashy nail set because of the holidays. You know, I wasn't in the mood for holiday nails. So now in the mood for some flashy nails. I want my rhinestones. I want my 3D flowers. I want it all. So I'm over here. So I actually created a little photo album on Instagram. It's called my blue nails. And I just pretty much just saved a bunch of like blue nail designs. And I'm over here trying to figure out what exactly I want done. And it's just so confusing. So I have picked out this one. It's really pretty. I love the little swirly things. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. I just don't know if she has that type of sparkly glitter. I don't know if she can make that. So that's option number one. I definitely don't want the shape of that nails, but I like the design. So that's option number one. And then I thought about doing like this right here. This is so flashy, so cute. I love rhinestone nails, but rhinestone nails don't like me. Like my nails get snagged into my hairs. So this is definitely a, probably a no for me, but I really, really like that option. Okay. And then this is why I'll never send her because she likes for us to send us, send her the design that we're going to get like the day before we get our nails done. And I'd be like, I don't know. Like I got to get the proper, but look at that. That's so simple, but it's also cute. I want like a light blue. I don't want any more dark colors on my nails right now. So I seen this nail set and I think this might be the one I get. I just don't want that pink base. I want a more of a neutral base, but I think I might get this set. It's really, really pretty. And I know she got these rhinestones and stuff. I'm just not sure if she has the, um, this color. So yeah, I'm definitely gonna, as a matter of fact, let me send this to her now. Yeah, send this to my nail girl now. And then, let's see. I'll explain to her what I'm stuck in the decision when I see you tomorrow. Cause she usually like, girl, okay, what's the dealio? I'm like, oh, those are cute too. I don't want no dark blue nails. No, I definitely want a light blue nail design. Oh, these are cute too. Look at those. Oh my gosh. I just don't know what to do. I guess y'all gonna have to wait until next vlog to see because I'm gonna end today's vlog today because yeah, I'm gonna end it today so that way I can have it uploaded for Saturday for you guys. So yeah, Leon. Yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I just, I figure it out. Yeah, who did this? Who did this? This is why mommy don't like buying out toys because look, who gonna clean this up? Me. You? Me. No, you. <laughs> up. Pay with your car. Why are you not on your nap schedule, dude? This is usually the time you go to sleep. No more naps? <laughs> oh, Bumpster. <laughs> and I got a car out here. That's cute. I can make that. Of course he did. Boy, big boy. 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 Happy birthday to Bubba. Happy birthday to Bubba. 
happy birthday, bubba bubba boy. Happy birthday to you. Woo! <laughs> so this is one of his favorite toys. Levine, look. <gasps> Baba, are you with her? Ooh. And then I got you some squishy sensory balls. You know, I don't care about the balls. I want this. Oh, wait, I got you some more stuff for you. Look. And then look. This is good for sensory, too. It's a sensory fun. Look. And he's like, I want my thingies. Okay. If I got a child with autism, this is going to be really good. Teaching them different sensories and textures and stuff. So. Yeah, I got this. I know you want to play with this stuff too. Can you say ball? I want ball. What color? Blue. That's not blue. What color is that? Oh, you point to oh, you point to the package. My bad. Yes, but I mean the inside. What color you want? You want this one or this one? No. No, which one? Purple. Purple. Okay. Look. Ah! Ah! That squeeze it hard. Look at the ball! <laughs> and throws. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Let me reach and grab it. <laughs> ow, ow. Oh, <laughs> 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 <laughs>